And so Jack, Jack talks about there about, you know, telling your friends to buy Bitcoin. And I agree with that. I do. And I think it's, it's a worthwhile cause. But at the same time, I think we really need to be focusing our energy on, like, if you had a piece of paper, you had a piece of paper and you wrote down, you had five names that you could write down that you really gave a shit about. Like, really, not just, you know, hoping to be a good person, hoping to get some goodwill in the world. Maybe that's your dad, your mom, your brother, your sister, and your spouse or your best friend or whoever it is. Focus on those five. Oh, I need to top up here. I'm going to run out of sats. Yikes. It says I'm zero minutes remaining. I think I saw that. We would have been cut off. There we go. That was a close one. What the hell is I talking about? Yeah, folks, the five people, focus on them. Because at the end of the day, we can only do so much. We have to take care of ourselves. It's up to us. And, you know, if you're somebody who's gotten to the point of like you've tried with those five people you wrote down, you've tried your best, then honestly, what I would do, and, you know, this might sound a little bit crazy and some people might not go for this, but what I would do is I would just take some sats that you have, label it mom, label it dad, label it brother, sister, best friend, spouse. Create a wallet for each of them. Put some sats in there at this rate and just forget about it. Forget you even had those sats. And so then if something were to happen, you know, like if this plays out like we think it's going to do, then you don't have to spend any more time doing it. You already have sats for them. They, they might never figure it out. They might never get, you know, onto YouTube and start watching people and learning how to do this stuff or giving a shit about it. So if you truly care about them, if this is something that you really want to take on, and then you, you can save your time and energy and put it towards something else. Instead of worrying that they're going to be left out of this, just put some in there for them. Worst, best case, they figured out themselves and you just take those sets back. You don't tell them that you have these wallets set aside for them. You just do it. And then if they need it, it's there for them. If they don't, they're still yours. But then you don't have to, you don't have to spend time worrying about it. Spend time trying to convince them to do it. And the whole orange peeling thing, I think that that's a term that we need to outlaw in Bitcoin. Because when you're orange pilling somebody, you're, sh you're putting it into their mouth. They're, you're shoving it down their throat. Nobody wants anything shoved down. Well, <laughs> nobody wants anything shoved down their throats. So for, don't think in those terms. Just try to do your best to open up people's mind. They'll get there when they're ready. And if not, that's not your problem. Focus on the people who have that open mind already. That's what I would say on that.